the rice water as you can all see this is the rice water my rice water okay so please ladies just follow the way I showed you how to do it this is my first time as well to make the, the, the rice water so let's get into it let me show you how I created this really nice water I love it it's quite good so please ladies once you put everything inside and close this lid don't open it you have to leave it to fermented infused for the length of time you wanted to leave it for me I'm gonna leave it for a month because I want to see really good results I'm gonna leave it for a month too yeah I'm going to leave it for one month to fermented yes so this is it my rice water yeah this is my rice water rice water that's it don't open the lid once you close the lid when you put the essential oil you put them this is the two i use once you put the essential oil the great food peel the water and the rice that's it you're not going back to open it and start putting things now i left it to ferment it infused i'm gonna leave mine for um four weeks a month yeah because the yahoo women they leave theirs for longer i don't know three months or so but i'm gonna leave mine for four weeks some people leave it for one week but i want to see a really fast result because i've lost my hair so i am in the journey to grow it back and i want to see results this year i couldn't do all my ponytail i like leaving my own hair to have you know so please ladies let's get into it how i make my guys water hello ladies hi i hope everyone is doing fine under this quarantine as we all know things are really difficult right now with everything so today's topic i'm just going to share with you how to make your own rice water i've been hearing a lot of people talking about rice water so this is why i'm gonna try it out myself <laughs> i want to try it out myself so these are all what you're gonna need you need your good food and you need your jar where you're gonna put everything need the hair tight one all right uh, you're gonna do like this you close it and then you push it right down push it right down so if you want to open push it back if you want to open you just pull this and bring it down and you open it okay and then you use this to ferment it when you want to ferment it, your rice water this is what you use i don't know if i'm saying the word right fermented yeah or infused so the other thing i'm going to talk about as well i'm using the boiling cool water yeah i'm going to use the boiling cool water just because when you heat up and water then it becomes really healthy and nice to use yes so this is the reason why i'm using boiling water but leave it to cool down yes because as we all know the water we use in europe is recycled water we keep recycling and add more medication for it so if we're going to use more of the water for for our hair it's good sometimes we do something about it just like when we're using hot water to have a shower so that one is good so if i'm going to uh, 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 do my what my rice water i prefer to use boiling water leave it to cool down that's what i'll be using so it helps with itchy you know it doesn't make my scalp itchy or, or irritate you know so it look like white and brown but it's white if you come close it's just mixed so in this case you can use any type of rice depending on what suits you so you can use any type of rice and then you don't need to have specific measurement how many cups of rice you should use just go ahead and use any amount that you want to use for the day yeah because i'll be using it a lot here so that's why i got this big jar yeah 
so that's why i got lots of fries here as well because it's time for me to try it i i made an attempt one time to try it but um i didn't i didn't know how to do it so this is my first time now i'm going to really properly to try it so as you can all see this is the rice i'm using it looked like a brown rice but it's white it's white rice this too because they're really good for hair it, it stimulates the hair scalp it's quite good so that's why i'm using the peppermint i'll be using peppermint peppermint essential oil then i'm using the rosemary i'm using the rosemary there i'm going to wash the the um grapefruit and the rice now Let's go ahead and I'll show you now. Washing all that chemical out. I've washed the rice. The rice is washed now. I've all washed our orange. This is our hair tight jar. Boiling water, coal, rosemary oil, and peppermint. Even if they short shots, you can just yeah. Save this for later, then I'm going to tell you an interesting topic. So let's put that there. So when you close it so I'm going to use now the boiling water but leave it to cool down I'll be using the boiling water leave it to cool down okay then you don't also have to measure the water you can just use whatever and then that's it see don't let it come right up quickly put too much water you can just go ahead and use your bowl and get some out so you you will be able to close the lid yeah just reduce the water there because you don't want when you close the lid then the water will... so it's time to add in the essential oil i'm gonna use like this one the oil is open so i'm just gonna use small that's enough I'll just use uh, five drops my rosemary I'm using five drops and we can use the spoon we use before to reduce the water and just stir it a bit 
let the essential oil go everywhere just stir it a bit and then see as you see the oil there the oil is sitting up so we need to stir it a bit that's it close it For the essential oil to go underneath. Yeah, lady, this is the rice water, really nice. I love the look of it, it's nice. So please leave it to ferment it for four weeks. Don't open. Don't open it. Because once you open it, you spoil the process. So you have to leave it, leave the lid on. If you're keeping it for two weeks, one week, a month, don't open it, leave it. Because this is how it fermented, infused. So please, ladies, so you leave it like that. It's all ready now. It's really nice. So I can't wait to try it. Good, 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 good. I can't wait to try it for my hair. And I can see good results with the aloe vera. The aloe vera is quite good as well. I'm seeing good results because it's in my cream, my body wash, my face scrub, my moisturizer cream for my hair and my body. I'm adding aloe vera. As you can see my skin, no makeup right now. No makeup. This is all my skin. So you see? Aloe vera is, I'm seeing good results for it, really good. All right, ladies. So. Okay, ladies, let's talk about this letter I received from the NHS about taking part for the COVID 19. So, I don't know which kind of test they just said we search. So, yeah, yeah, let me look for the letter now. So, yeah, this is the letter. Let's see what so, it says. I received this letter. College London they want me to take part with the COVID-19 test studies yeah so it's an independent research organized on behalf of the Department of Health and Social Care yes it's really scary I don't know which kind of test is this they want me to take for it's really 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 scary for me to do yeah, I don't know if any one of you received this kind of letter. Yeah, from the Imperial College, um, London. Department of Health and Social Care. Yeah, so as we all know, we got NHS in England. So they say it's a large COVID-19 test research study in England. So I think they're asking some people to take part which I'm really scared of. I received this letter with my name on it, my address on the 18th, on the 8th of September. On the 8th of September, I don't know. So that's me there, that's my name there. That's my name there, and that's the college. You see, so they asked me to take a part. Hmm. I don't know COVID-19 research study it's scary for me right now what should I do shall I take part or just leave it go yeah mm. scary though really scary so let's bear in mind with that if injection or something I'll not be taking part of this yeah my name is there everything my address date of birth if anybody else receive this kind of letter please 
Can you share it down below? Yes. Look. Share it down below, please, ladies. Yeah, that's my name there. My, you see? So. Yeah. Oh, this is good. I'm enjoying this. I'm going to leave this for one more. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe and like. And comment about these studies as well, people in England, if you receive any letter. Let me know. So if you're going, me too, I'll go. Thank you. See you soon. Bye-bye. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe and like if this video is for you. Give it a thumbs up and comment. Let's share, please.